What's going on YouTube? Welcome back to Sig's Kitchen. I'm Big Sig. Today we're going to be making one of my favorite dishes, as I always tell you, because all my dishes are my favorite dishes. But we're making stuffed peppers. So I just wanted to say, sorry we haven't put out a new video. I had a couple people in my family die at the same time. So I want to dedicate this video to my cousin Sasha Peralta and Michael Lapizzo. This one's for you. Cheers. Rest in peace. All right, so now that we've gotten past that, it's time to get into the video. Let's get into the ingredients. Pepper. Garlic. One egg. Hamburger. Parsley. Breadcrumb. Onion. Mozzarella cheese. Pecorino Romano cheese. Pasta sauce. Adobo dough. Salt and pepper. White rice. All right, so first we're gonna start by telling our peppers exactly what I like to tell my women. Take your top off. We're gonna cut the tops. We're gonna go in. We're gonna just de-seed. Take a little bit of that white meat out. Also, when you're looking for peppers, make sure you find the ones that stand up. It'll make your life 10 times better when you're getting ready to stop stuffing them, okay? What I like to do is I like to just cut this up and I'm gonna throw it right into our stuffing. You can put it back on if you wanna make it look all pretty. I'm in it for the taste, not for the looks. Like my woman. Now that you saw us get our peppers nice and topless, we're gonna turn on our heat. We're gonna let the pan get hot. We're gonna put a little bit of olive oil. We're gonna throw those peppers, some onions, and the garlic, and we're gonna start sauteing that. Remember, when the pan's hot enough to burn your hand, it's hot enough to cook your food. In the meantime, have a cold beer, wait, and enjoy yourself. All right, so now that our pan's nice and hot, we're gonna throw down the olive oil. You can use whatever oil you want. Could be regular cooking oil, could be avocado oil. Also, just wanted to let you know, if you want your peppers to be softer, you can always go ahead and blanch them, which means just boil them in hot water for a couple minutes. Me personally, I like a little bite, so we don't. So let's stuff this pan like we're about to stuff these peppers. Vegetables. In. Yeah. Oh, yeah. Saute. 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 So now that our peppers and our onion are nice and translucent, we're going to add in some garlic. We're using three large garlic cloves because garlic is the best thing in the world. Now that all this is going, Time to add that meat. We're gonna break up that hamburger, get it all chopped up, mixed in with your veggies. Then we're gonna hit it with that adobo dough. Yes, sir. So now that our hamburger is cooked, shut your heat off. We're gonna move on to the next step. Seriously, though. We're gonna take our rice, we're gonna take our meat. Now I used lean 93% because I didn't want to have a whole bunch of grease left over for this recipe. You can use whatever you like, and you know me, grease is flavor, baby. But for this, we're going lean. We're gonna to toss that meat right into our white rice mixture. It's already cooked. We're gonna just keep hitting the pot to make some kitchen music. Okay, that's enough. Now, we're gonna take this pot and we're gonna come back over here. We're here. Come back, grab your beer, then back over to here. Now we're gonna go back over here, get our spoon, and come back over to here. Take a sip. Remember, exercise, it's healthy. We're just gonna mix this up, get our rice and our hamburger mixed together, Normally I would get in here with my hands and just massage the meats, but it's super hot and I don't feel like burning myself on camera again. 
If you want to see that, check out my other videos where I do stupid shit. And I mean any video, because literally all I do is stupid shit. So we're going to take a little bit of pasta sauce. Don't judge me. Yes, it's canned. I could have made one, but the video needs to be certain lengths for you to watch and me to get subscriptions. So make sure to like, share, and subscribe with the rest of your friends, okay? We're going to add a little bit of this tomato sauce. We're going to take this grated cheese. We're going to take breadcrumb. Don't be a crummy person. Make sure you add enough. We're going to take one egg. Boom. And then we're going to take some of that fresh parsley we got. We're going to give it a quick, how you doing? Quick chop. Huzzah. Going to mix things up. Get in there with your hands. Don't be a pussy. It's burning. It's hot. It's hot. Literally too hot to do. Nope, stop, can't do it. Literally burning my hands. I'm gonna snap my fingers and we'll be back with the spoon. Well, guess you don't have to go look at another video because guess what? I did some stupid shit. We're gonna continue to stir this. Now, we're gonna take a little bit of this mozzarella. Yes, you can use fresh. A little bit of this into the pot. We're gonna take a little bit of salt. And then we're just gonna mix the rest of this up. Hands. With spoons, not your hands. Take a sip of your beer. Rethink life. Next step, tomato. We're gonna take that sauce and we're just gonna hit the bottom of the pan. Smooth it out. This will stop your peppers from sticking. Otherwise, you'll be in a sticky situation. So now that we got the pan lined, beautiful. More cheese. Romano, and you're gonna hit the bottom of that pan. Then, you're gonna look. Make sure you don't cook your stickers because nobody likes to eat that. We're gonna put one, two, three, four, and five. I did a stand-up job. They're all standing up. You deserve to have a drink. Cheers. Now, we're gonna get to the business. We're gonna take this meat stuffing. We're gonna grab our pepper. Don't worry about that little guy. You're gonna take, push it into the corners, everything. You wanna load these with as much meat as possible. That's what she said. Okay. Repeat. Stuff it. You're gonna be just as stuffed as these peppers when you're done. As you can see, we have plenty of meat mixture left. Nothing goes to waste. We're gonna fill in around all these peppers and it's gonna be absolutely delicious. So now that we got everything stuffed, we're gonna take a little bit of sauce. We're gonna go right over the top of these peppers. And while these are cooking, we're going to get saucy. We've put our sauce. We're going to come back. We're going to hit it one more time with some cheese. And then we're going to top it with that mozzarella. I'm going to pick up all the cheese I'm dropping all over my floor. Oven's preheated, 400 degrees. Look at these bad boys. Into the oven we go. Bye. All right, we've reached that time. Let's do this. Oh yeah. Absolutely gorgeous. And there you have it. Burning, sizzling, ready to melt my face off for your enjoyment. Just listen to this. Perfectly crunchy cheese. It makes me cheese so big. So the piece de resistance. We're gonna. And we're gonna sprinkle for some garnish. You ready for this? Because I know I am. K. 
Okay. Take a little bit of that extra meat. And boom. Stuck pep is at its finest. And now, let me stuff my face. Mm, mm, mm. 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 I'll tell you what, if you don't like Italian stuffed peppers, you can just get the fuck out of my kitchen. With a pep in your step. Dun, dun, dun.